Take a square sheet of paper and fold it in half diagonally. Open and repeat for the other diagonal. Open the sheet. You should see these creases. Rotate the page and fold it in half. Repeat for the other side. These creases will allow you to fold everything inward, like this. Fold one side first, then the other. And you get this shape. Then fold this point on the center line. Repeat for the other side. Then fold the top by following the center and using this line as a reference point. Unfold like this. Open and fold inward using the creases you just made. Then unfold this part. Lift up this part and fold using these two ends. Repeat for the other side. Now fold this part onto the center line. Repeat for the other side. When you have this shape, take the lower part and fold it until you can't go any further, revealing this little point. Open it. Use this new crease to fold the point like so. Repeat for the new crease. Make a crease on this center point. The following fold is complicated. Fold this part. Use the crease here to lift up the point and fold.
Now flip the fish. Pull the fish head this way. Flip it again and fold this big point backward. Make a nice crease. This point touches the nose. So fold by following the central line. This is the same crease that has been done before for the other side. Then fold upward like this using the crease you just made. Open and fold on the crease. Now fold at the intersection of the center line and the last crease. Once you have this shape, finish the tail just like on the other side, but instead folding downward. Do this by folding this point up to the junction of the two, then folding downward. Just make one final fold back to finish your angelfish.